As you move into your Earth year of 2013, we would speak to you about the new terrain, the merge between space and time, and the dissolution and reconstruction of the third density reality. For those within the fifth density reality, aware of it, moving in and out of it and embracing its presence, then 2013 will be much more of a smooth ride, if you will. 2012 was a year of rapid karmic cleansing and clearing on many levels, for those who steer the ship of Earth. 2013 is when the true work begins, yet work in service to the light in a more recognisable and tangible form. Individuals are reshaping the work they do in alignment with the new terrain, and this shall be much fun and hold great reward. Many of the individuals you knew as students, clients and followers of your work now take their places as teachers, practitioners and creators of their own templates in 2013. The new terrain is very much about creation. Drawing down the top of the pyramid, if you will, and activating the bottom of the pyramid. This many know as the Merkaba. And for those embracing 5D reality, one could say that 2013 for you is the year of the Merkaba. For so many of you now stand within the aligned higher geometry, within the 5D light body, having activated the upgraded chakra system that connects with the 5D reality. For many of you, accessing this can be done simply by visualization, as you have emotional vibrations fully aligned with the 5D reality and a fully formed light body template. For you, the merge has taken place. The higher reality is much easier to access now that Earth herself has also embraced her Merkaba geometry and exists within the fifth dimensional reality. For many of you, newly birthed into the fifth dimension, it may still be a moving in and out of realities, as you may find that vibrations of other individuals, places, certain music, chemicals, food, drink, and other energies pull you down, if you will, back into 3D. In the truest reality, no one and nothing can pull you out of your 5D experience except yourself. But it may feel as though this has been caused by an outside source as you take your first steps in this new reality on Earth. You will learn quickly how to transmute and transcend certain vibrations. But for now, it is most wise to remain within aligned vibratory energies, especially with your nutrition and liquid intake. You may find, regarding nutrition, that whilst you can eat and consume anything and not be affected by it regarding the health of your physical body, you will find it somewhat harder to connect to the fifth dimension when your nutritional choices are not aligned. For those who have not yet felt the presence of the 5D reality or felt the 5D light body merge, then the aligned nutritional path for you is paramount. Once this is aligned and the work has been done on cleansing the fields and thinking with the expanded mind, then the light body merge, which has indeed already taken place for you, will be felt. The presence of the fifth dimensional reality will be felt. In fact, it will call to you. The beings who reside within this reality will call to you. And this reality will be embraced by you and lived within. The new terrain is about creation, as you plant seeds within the cyclical, spiralling reality within the new space-time, time-space merge. 
so too do you plant seeds within your minds, your bodies, your hearts and thus your lives. The space-time-time-space merge is the meeting of matter and antimatter to form the sacred Vesica Pisces geometry. The central point within the Vesica Pisces being the zero point. Exist within this geometry and you will find that all dimensions and all realities become one for you and you live within a unified field. Choosing your dimension should you wish to access dualistic reality and returning to the zero point field, the centre of the Vesica Pisces to feel unity and oneness with Source. This is your God presence and it is here where you become a God realised being. Know and feel the simultaneous matter-antimatter merge and you truly become Source incarnated in human physicality with all the knowing of what has been, what is and what shall be. The dissolution and reconstruction of third density reality from your perspective began several years ago for your planet and this has been more and more evident as the energies on your planet have intensified. Your year of 2012 brought much dissolution. We could use the word collapse, if you will, to describe much of the systems as the energies of greed, power and need for control simply could not sustain with the rising frequencies on Earth. The critical mass points of bliss-charged love created by the collective mindset of the aware individuals and their open and activated heart centres created such a love-light resonant field that service to self vibrations could no longer thrive and take hold. For those in full 3D reality, the embracing of the full spectrum of energies is not yet there to be perceived by you. So still these individuals see the service to self control realities as winning the game if you will. Action for them comes from fear-based activity and whilst some of these activities do contribute towards the overall reconstruction of the new reality, the majority of fear-based activities just add to the repeating cycle of darker, lower vibrations. Those in 3D reality that are aware of the 5D reality and those existing within 4D reality can see the pattern behind the breakdowns and collapses within the 3D reality. These individuals are set to experience the full merge and access memories of the evolutionary spike that took place on the 21st of December 2012. This wave takes place as a series of smaller waves and many will be coming into this now from your perspective in physicality. From our perspective, all individuals embracing fifth dimensional reality have already made the jump. So your year of 2013 brings much more evidence of this breakdown of the 3D reality and much more evidence of the reconstruction in the new forms. For those in 5D reality now, the dissolution and breakdown will not be experienced, for your dimension does not carry this frequency. As you operate from the 5D light body, this collapse of the 3D world cannot touch your reality. Your world is full of synchronicity, abundance, joy, creation, magical meetings, magical moments and bliss. Your reality is that of service to others and unity with Source. However, you may be made aware of the dissolutions and the reconstructions, as many of the reconstructions will be founded within higher vibrational streams. If they are to sustain, then this must be so. As long as you view the dissolutions with the objective eye 
Feel the genuine compassions. Send the healings and the light from 5D and remain within 5D. This viewing will not affect your reality. Action for you is true action within the flow of Source. Should you find yourself pulled into the 3D experience at any time, know this is temporary. For all those who have opened the stargates into 5D, return to 5D. We repeat, all those who have opened the stargates into 5D, return to 5D. Once in that realm, in the fifth dimensional reality, the magnetics are within you, within your cells. The cellular change into the crystalline form has begun to take place and has taken place. The higher stranded DNA formation has begun to form and has formed. Therefore, this higher reality cannot be lost on a permanent basis, for it is your home. In the truest reality, this is the case for all beings. For all beings eventually move upwards within the cyclical spiral of consciousness, returning to source with new individualized self-sense and begin again a new journey of creation. We would say then that your year of 2013 is the year of the Merkaba. The Merkaba geometry embraced by your planet Earth and by all those ascending and ascended beings, aware of and existing within the fifth dimension. Critical mass points of Merkaba geometry within the collective consciousness of humanity are set to be reached in your year of 2013. Working consciously on the activation of this geometry is a most aligned focus for you at this time. And whilst this can be done in many ways, such as yoga, tai chi, eurythmy and similar bodily movements, aligned nutrition, Merkaba meditations and visualizations, activations utilizing sound and color that matches the Merkaba field, and so many more unique creations, therapies and teachings. It is simply purity of thought, compassion, joy and bliss-charged love that will activate this field. The more you feel love within your heart, the more you can be assured that the Merkaba geometry sets within your energetic magnetic fields. One does not have to take part in the Merkaba meditations and activations. These are tools, and most aligned tools, but not essential for the Merkaba field to activate. Therefore, hold love, compassion, joy and bliss within your hearts as you embrace your Earth's new year of 2013, the year of the Merkaba. We are the white-winged collective consciousness of nine.